Good evening, SCCW fans, and welcome to another edition of Was a Night Voltage. My name is Astro Midfielder, host of commentators always, and, uh, <coughs> excuse me, pardon me if I do sound a bit different, as my, I myself am coming over a bit of sickness right now on the back end of a cold, so throat might uh, do a weird thing here and there throughout the show, and possibly even in tomorrow night as well, uh, when we're broadcasting Ignition. But, you know, it's not affecting me as heavily as it was over the weekend, so should be good there. Uh, very interesting week, uh, set up here, um, though I think in the case of it, it's Kingsley thinking ahead, especially considering what's on the horizon, which I will actually discuss more of what Kingsley's plans are at the end of tonight, since I did promise that next show we would be discussing those, but I figured it'd be best to hold off until the end to divulge such things. Uh, in the meantime, we actually do have a set of number one contendership matches set for this week, uh, which, knowing that, there is most definitely the likes of a, oh, whatchamacallit, a pay-per-view around the corner. I can't believe I blanked out on the word. So, I guess that'll probably be in the next, uh, two, three weeks at best. Knowing how Kingsley prefers to run things there on that, uh, timetable. So, expect to see something big in the next couple weeks. But, with all that said, and all that other way, let's get right down to business and jump right on in to the first match of the evening. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 245 pounds, Ricky Tressler. Got a new face here on the scene. I don't exactly have much on the guy, so to speak. Uh, I'm very interested to see what he brings here to the table here in Sin City. Huh. And his opponent from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 201 pounds, Kendrick Alexander. Meanwhile, Alexander, who's still looking to bounce back after that loss he suffered a couple weeks ago against Kenneth Casper, which, by the way, part of the week um, break that we had. Uh, I don't exactly know what it was, but Kingsley said that he needed to... I think it was like at least a wellness break for all talent. We're underway here. Oh, Jesus Christ, Trussell already with a massive knife and chop at Alexander with that rolling fireman's carry. Lock up here. Tressler has a mutt. Oh, and Alexander able to twist out of it. Lock up here. Couple of knees right to the face there. Uh, lock up. Just strength. Tressler pushing back. Ooh, over and shot right to the back. Oh, he has Alexander by the waist. Or spins around. Into the power bomb. One. Alexander able to easily get the shoulder, but the strength there by Tressler. He comes off. Ooh, big clothesline. Modified figure four locked in here. Alexander would have picked the lock with a swift elbow there, but Tressler quickly knocking him down. As him up, spins behind. Alexander spins behind since Tressler to the ropes. He comes off. One for the taste of midnight and missed. Oh, a series of elbows there from Tressler. This is the kick. Ooh, solid right hand. Tressler again with the elbows. As Alexander up, goes behind. Sleeping axe handle right to the top of the back. Pulls Alexander away. Turns him over. Cover here. One. Two. Oh, Alexander able to kick up before two. Misses on the drop kick. Lock up. Tressler again hammering with the elbows. Pulls Alexander away. And now we're seeing the hammer away with the right hands here. Oh, Alexander going to knock him aside. Lock up. Irish whip. Ooh, took Tressler down with that clothesline. Pulls him away. Has him up. Lock up. Oh, and now here they go. Tressler. Kendrick. Tressler. Kendrick. Tressler. Kendrick went in the exchange. Pulls Tressler away from the corner now. Sits him up. Knife fence chop. Lock up. Ooh, Kendrick unloading with that barrage of punches there. Whoop, but Tressler with that overhead kick. Back up on his feet. Alexander further away from the ropes. Double knees right across the stomach. Once the clothesline, lock up. Shot right to the ribs. Alexander pulling away from the ropes. Sets him up. 
Now Xander now off the road. Ooh, there's that single like drop kick. What's the clothesline of the zone? And shred oh! They can buy with a choke breaker there, but what a counter there by Alexander! Two lock up, Irish hook by Tressler. He comes off running neck breaker. As that nope, Alexander with a drop toe hold. Sets him up! Ooh! The leaping back kick to the head. Tressler slamming the knee off the canvas. He's coming off the rubs, and there's the neck breaker again. Alexander back up. Gets him down with the elbow. Mounts in our hammer away with the Give left up. hands. Give up. Tressler able to knock him aside. This is with that left. Alexander with the suplex. Now pulling Tressler away from the ropes. Sits him up. Knife heads chop. Lock up here. Irish up by Tressler. Waiting basement drop kick right to the knee. Has Alexander up. Whoa! Blue Thunder Bomb! Whoa! And Tressler has him. Up the Soul Breaker! Too close to the ropes! Alexander with a series of punches there. That's Tressler up. Tressler! Running Power Slam! Cover! One! Two! Alexander out hit the shoulder up in time. High fetch chop to the chest. And again. And a third time. Oh. Try to, try to go to the well one too many times. There, Tressler up top with the leg drop. Has Alexander up. Oh. The strikes there. Shot right to the throat. Tressler up top again. Another leg drop. Going up top once more. Scores again with the leg. Pulling Alexander away, has him up. This is the clothesline. A caught with the left. Oh, the grand line lariat cover. Too close to the ropes, says Carnegie. Ooh. Nice rolling scent on there from Alexander. Oh, walked into another grand line. Cover, too close to the ropes. Lock up. Tressler. Soul breaker! Too close to the ropes. Lock up. Swinging fisherman with the bridge. One, two. Tressler now with a kick out. Lock up. Dumps Alexander to the outside. Tressler with the axe handle off the apron. Get the breather and Alexander back up on his feet. Sends Tressler crashing into the guardrail. Walks right to that left hand. STF applied here on the floor. Tressler trying to wear down Kendrick even more. Got a count of 14 here. Count of 16. Oh, Tressler able to beat the count. Lock up. Here they go. Kendrick. Tressler. Kendrick. Tressler. Kendrick with the forearm. Tressler up, however. Oh, with the forearm. Has no Alexander inside cradle. One, two. Tressler out at the shoulder up. This is with the clothesline lock up. Has him up. There's the suplex. Tressler to the top. No, no one home for the leg drop. Alexander looking to take advantage. The night call. Not able to fully capitalize, however. Lock up. Oh, the choke breaker. Oh, my God. Tressel with a deadlift German. One, two. Alexander able to kick out. Lock up. Irish whip by Tressler, he's coming off as well. Oh, what a DDT! Tressler now trying to get a breather in. Lock up, Irish whip. Tressler off as well. Another DDT spiked Alexander on his head. Going up top. Leg drop to the back of the head. And Tressler into the STF now. Alexander taps out. Here is your winner by submission. Ricky Tressler!
and the newcomer victorious here in his debut. Oh, what a fight that was between the two. Nevertheless, Trestle able to overcome the midnight hour here. We're off to a positive start here in his career with SCCW. And honestly, that really could have gone either way there towards the end. But Tressler, the one to come out on top. It's definitely very, very positive start heading into the weeks ahead. All right, without further ado, folks, let's go ahead and jump right on into the next one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Barnsley, Yorkshire, England, weighing in at 320 pounds, Richard Energy! And Energy coming off a loss last week, have, well, not last week, two weeks ago, I should say. I'm so used to the habit of that. I haven't been defeated by Ichi Yamaguchi, but he's looking to bounce back here tonight. And his opponent! From Grozny, Chechen, Russia, weighing in at 104 pounds, Sister Valerie! Meanwhile, Sandy are coming off a victory two weeks ago, having overcome Jorman Gunder, and a rather bloody endeavor between those two. Now, able to walk away with the victory. Looking to see if she can continue her winning ways here tonight. Fight! There's the bell, and we're underway with this contest between these two. Valerie with that left hand. Ooh, and he just got slapped right down the chest. Right hand from Energy. Test of strength. Energy pushing back. Ooh, there's that over here shot to the back of the head. Two lock. Oh, oh, big slam. Energy pulling her away. Quick cover here. Both the Valerie easy getting the shoulder up. Two. Right hand there from Valerie. But he's there right to the midsection. Energy up on his feet. Irish whip gets into the corner. Lock up. Ooh, dumps foul to the outside. Ooh, goes back in. Lock up. Energy with the elbow. Slams the knee into the canvas. With his right hand. Elbow right to the back there for the foul. She pulls energy away. Rich up on his feet. Val working the arm a bit there. Caught him with the left. Lock up. That's the strength. Val able to push back. Touches him with the left. Drops energy with the elbow. Has him up. Lock up. Energy with that form across the back of the knee. Caught energy with the right hand. Energy throws her right down with that slam. Quick stomp. Ooh, caught her with the kick. Lock up. Ooh, slap right to the chest. Left hand. Ooh, nice stuck record there from Valerie. There's a fist drop right to the chest. Lock up. Well, here they go. Energy, Valerie. Energy, Valerie. Energy winning the exchange. Fist drop of his own. Bouncing our Henry away with these elbows. Oh, the Valley would knock the side. Lock up. Ooh, another slap right to the chest. Irish whip. Energy waiting. Oh, Luthes press one. Valerie able to get the shoulder up. Energy reverses. He's coming off the ropes. Oh, what a clothesline. Oh, my God. Energy off again, and there's the neck breaker. Lock up. Val picks the leg, and there's the dragon screw. Looks to the ribs. Energy back up on his feet. Val, hoist him up, and there's the suplex. Pulls energy away. Quick stomp, energy back up. Lock up here. Ooh, shot right to the ribs. Val maintaining control, she pulls him away. Off the ropes, ooh, kick right to the ribs. Lock up. Put these there to the midsection. She's coming off. Ooh, shot right to the ribs. To lock up. Val with the elbow. And Valerie now bridging back. Tenderizer applied. She can fully link her hands together. Energy able to pick the lock, however. Lock up. Val hoists him up, and there's a suplex, and out tumbles Energy. Up on his feet, goes back inside. Lock up. Irish whip. Val waiting. Slips behind. Oh, we got caught with the face breaker. Energy with the stomp, and again, 
Bowery back up. Walk up here. Oh, but energy with the backdrop. Up on his feet, as is Val. Couple of knees to the midsection there. Now pulling energy away, turn him over, cover here. One, two, energy over to get the shoulder up. Lock up. Valerie again, it's unloading with those knees right to the ribs. Pulls energy away, turns him over, another cover here. One, two, energy, get the shoulder up. This is the clothesline. Get to the midsection. Valerie, divide smite! Pulls energy away. As a pestilence applied! Energy and serious trouble. I'm amazed at Valerie abandoned it that far back. But Big Rich able to pick the lock. Lock up. Get to the midsection. Val again. Divide Smite! And Fisher might have caught him on the nose with that as well. Yeah, there is blood flowing. Lock up. Energy throws her to the corner. Lock up. And now chop it away! Oh my god. Just blood leaking everywhere. Irish whip, Valor coming off. Flying knee right to the face. Val back up on her feet, so is Rich. Open Rich. Has her up here. Jackhammer cover. One, two. Val able to get the shoulder up in time. Lock up. It was, oh, double underhook suplex! Energy! Oh, that was stirring! Kick to the midsection! Divide Smart finds its mark! Val pulled him away! Has the lock! Pestilence applied! Is Energy gonna tap here? In serious trouble! Energy able to break free! Drops it out to the back of the head. He dropped to the back. That's Val up. This is the clothesline. An energy running power slam. Has Val up. Into the corner. Lock up. Whoop. Lock up. Whoop. Energy with the kick to the midsection. Val up. Hangman's neck breaker. Valerie right back up. Lock up. Energy puts her in the corner, going after. Scoops her up. Trio Woe. Oh, now just unloading with the kicks to the midsection there. Lock up. Oh, here they go. Valerie. Energy. Valerie. Energy. Valerie. With the forearm. That's, oh, energy with the elbow. Energy goes behind. There's the backdrop. Down on the canvas, energy back up on his feet first, quickly followed by Val. Has her up, however. P D A pulls her away. Cover one, two, three. He got her. Here is your winner by pinfall, Richard Energy, and Big Rich able to bounce back from his loss and a couple of weeks ago well what a bloody war metaphorically and literally that was for him to overcome man oh man it honestly that really could have gone either way between those two but energy able to get the winning edge over Valerie here tonight it's definitely a much needed one for him as well on top of it congrats to Rich a very impressive victory All right, without further ado, folks, let's go ahead and jump right on into the next one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Onimichi Hiroshima, Japan, weighing in at 200 pounds, Eiichi Yamaguchi. Eiichi coming off a victory a couple of weeks ago, having defeated Richard Energy on voltage. Doesn't look a lot more like his uh, previous self when he was with MCW. And his opponent from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 241 pounds, Hunter Storms! And meanwhile, Storms coming off a loss after a couple of weeks ago, which 
while he was defeated once again by Jeff Gilliam, those two certainly put on an absolute classic between themselves. And the question is, can Storms find a way to bounce back? Especially against the likes of Yamaguchi here. He's run away. Storm throwing him right down to the canvas. Each quickly back up on his feet. He gets thrown right back down. Looks onto to the ribs that time. Neichi trying for the lover's last kiss there, but Storms dumps him overhead. And now Henry away with the right hands here on Yamaguchi. Neichi knocks him aside. Both men to their feet. Lock up. Put Storms in the corner. Lock up. Storms. Whoop gets pushed into the corner. Lock up. Whoop. Storms reverses the Irish whip. Going after Yamaguchi. Catches him with that elbow. Ooh, and there's a shot right to the ribs that takes down the Gold Rush God. Sits him up. Ooh, there's a snap kick right to the back. Lock up. Throws Yamaguchi down. Storms turns the Ooh, sharpshooter. Very interesting move from him that time. Very used to just seeing the Clover leaf. Throws Yamaguchi down. Sits him away. Cover here. Easy, easy getting the shoulder up. Lock up. Flip Storms with the hip toss. Cut through back up on his feet. The boy's back just got caught with the left. Lock up. Throws Yamaguchi down. Really just using, I think, size advantage there. Cover here. Oh, nearly managing a one count that time, but still no dice. He gets caught with that knee. And Yamaguchi now will load with a ground and pound. Storm shrugs him off. Lock up. Irish whip. Oh, coming off. Oh, what a shote there by Yamaguchi. To lock up. Put Storms in the corner. Lock up. Yamaguchi fires him across in the corner. Takes the run up. There's the elbow. Lock up. Well, here they go. Aichi. Storms. Aichi. Storms. Aichi winning the exchange. Well, storms away. Good cover. One. Storms easy. Getting the shoulder up. Lock up. And Aichi puts him in the corner. Puts him with that left. Measuring to whoop. To avoid that right hand. Ooh, fish chopped to the throat, but Storms throws him into the corner. Lock up. Ooh, but he gets kicked away there. Ichi coming off the rope. Storms makes it to his feet. Lock up. Storms with the elbow. Hooks onto the back. Lock up. Oh, new stare down. Storms the shot to the ribs. Stomp to the ribs that time as well. We're focusing on the torso. Ichi has him. Lover's last kiss. One. Two! Storm's able to kick out. Ooh, got caught with that right hand. Avoids the takedown. Storm. Oh, might have been looking for the backdrop, but Eiji had it scouted. That Storm's up. Block up here. Storm throws him right down. Busts the legs. Turns him over. Sharpshooter applied. Hoping to Eiji able to escape. Lock up. Whoop. Eiji able to trip him up. Or tackle him down, I should say. Quick stomp to the leg. As Storms up, ooh, got caught with a kick to the midsection. Storms drops him with the elbow, slams the knees right into the canvas, and again. Backing up, ooh, caught him with a kick to the back that time. Storms again, just throwing him right down. Comes off the ropes, there's a fish drop right to the jaw. Walk up here, Storms again, taking down with the elbow, turns him over, cover this time, one. Each easy to get the shoulder up there. Lock up. Storm spoke. Oh, might have looking for the backdrop again, but Ichi once more had it telegraphed. And Ichi now mounts Henry away with the ground and pound here. Oh, Jesus. Storm's able to knock him aside. Lock up. Elbow there from Storms. Again, maintaining control. Another elbow, and this time drops down. Camel clutch. One of his other patent submission maneuvers. Ichi able to escape it. Walk up. Storms has some hook here. Implant DDT. Dropped him. Cover one, two. Ichi able to kick out. Walk up. Irish whip. Ichi coming off as well. To collide. Lock up. Storms has him hooked. This time he gets the backdrop. Both men up on their feet here. Lock up. Whoop. Storms. Has him! Hooked here! Hollow crown! One! Two! Aichi having a kick out! Whoop it storms! Daybreak drove him down! Cover! One! Two! Aichi having a kick out! Lock up! 
Catches him with that left. Irish whip. Oh! He says, wrath of God there is what he calls that flying knee of his cover. One, two. Storm's able to kick out. Oh! The rib crunching shot. Ichi lining him up here. Gold Rush Alpha! Turn storms over, cover, too close to the ropes. Ooh, can see Ichi with that right. Oh, but Ichi again with that shot to the ribs. Pull storms away. Again lighting him up. Gold Rush Alpha! Turns him over, cover, one, two. Storms able to get the shoulder up in the neck of time. In the breather in, Ichi back up on his feet, but Storms has him hooked. Implant DDT. Cover here, one, two. Ichi kicks out. Walk up. Oh, here they go. Ichi, Storms, Ichi, Storms. Ichi with the forearm. He's getting a breather in while he can. Storms back up on his feet, lock up. Oh. The elbow there. Might be smoke, got caught with that elbow. And again with that shot right to the ribs. Ichi lining him up. Oh, Gold Rush Alpha number three. That has to be it. Turns him over. Cover one, two. No, Storms kicks out again. Goes to the top. Connects with the knee. Pulls a each away. Has him up. Lock up here. Storms has him hooked. Hollow crown. Too close to the ropes. Lock up. Stor Storms again looking for it. Hollow crown! Too close to the ropes, which I really feel like Carnegie needs to get his eyes shut because that looked nowhere near the ropes to me. Pulls Aichi away. Well, Aichi able to tackle him down. Pulls Storms away. Guard position. Oh, into that triangle choke. He's used the submission maneuver before to tap others out. Storms able to hold on. As Aichi. Ooh, got him with that shot to the back of the head. Aichi back up. This is with the takedown. Lock up. Storms has him hooked again. Implant DDT. Cover here. One, two, three. He got him. Here is your winner by pinfall. Hunter Storms. And Cutthroat able to squeeze out the victory in the end over Yamaguchi which I'm honestly very surprised by considering the amount of GRAs he took to the head. But nevertheless, that is the tenacity of the ring veteran. That is Hunter Storms there. The very big victory over Yamaguchi there, and a much needed one as well. That's the Storms there. Is that honestly has surprised me. All right, without further ado, folks, let's go ahead and jump right on into the next one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first from Fairfield, New Mexico, weighing in at 310 pounds, Colin Colinton. Meanwhile, the former world heavyweight champ is looking to get back on it, at least regain some momentum ever since he's lost. The World Heavyweight Championship to Jason Justice. If uh, there's a good time to do it, it's probably right about now. And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing at 285 pounds, Jeff Gilliam! And meanwhile, Jeffy G coming off a victory two weeks ago, having defeated Hunter Storms and their classic with one another. He's looking to continue his winning ways here tonight, but he faces a very determined and honestly animalistic Cliff Clinton. Fight. So we'll see how things go here. It's underway. Lock up here. Gilliam with a shot right to the ribs. Lock up. Gilliam scoops him up and throws him right down. 
Lock up. Elbow there from Clinton. Two lock up. Oh. Ooh, just a shot right to the back of the head. Two lock up here. Irish whip. Clinton just crashing into the padding there. Ooh, big headbutt there. As Clinton pulls him away. Ooh, drops the elbow to the cover. Gilliam easily got the shoulder up. Looks like a lot more than a simple elbow drop to put him down. Clinton still maintaining control here. Again dropping another big elbow, but Gilliam pushes him some right off. Slap right to the chest there from Clinton. Oh, that's Gilliam bridging followaway slam. Jeff able to kick out. Misses with the elbow there. Clinton has him in that face lock. Drops the elbow. Two. Oh. Sizing each other up. Oh, Clinton with the kick. Rocks Gilliam with the headbutt. Pulls him away. Ooh, got met with that boot to the face. Oh, avoids the headbutt. Gilliam with that right hand. Irish whip coming off the ropes. Whoa, and Clinton just taking that boot like a champ and launches Gilliam with the belly to belly. Oh my lord. Now he pulls Gilliam away. Has him up. Ooh, got caught with that right hand. Lock up. Oh, now here they go. Gilliam. Clinton. Gilliam. Clinton. Gilliam. Clinton winning the exchange. Oh, he's back up to his feet. Whoop, got caught with that body blow. Knee lift right to the midsection. Lock up. Irish whip. Gilliam now waiting for him. Went quickly back inside. To lock up here. And Gilliam with a double leg slam. Oh, fist drop right to the nose. This is the headbutt. Gilliam with the elbow. There's that stomp. Lock up. Irish whip. Not, ooh! That shoulder tackle. Cover your one. Nope. Oh, not even a count of one. Lock up. Big headbutt there by Clinton. Pulls Gilliam away. Has him up. Ooh, one two combination. Gilliam, however, control. There's the elbow. There's Clinton up. Circles around in front. Ooh, he gets spiked across the back with that forearm. He's able to trip Clinton. Lock up. Oh, reverses the Irish whip. Gilliam measuring. Takes the oh, what a boot! Just sent Clinton spiraling down to the mat. It's caught with that knee lift, however. Clinton has him up. Caught with the elbow. Ooh! Nice drop kick there from Gilliam. Both men up on their feet. Lock up. Oh, but Clinton unloading with the punches here. Down goes Jeffy G. Has him up. Clinton coming off the ropes. Running headbutt. Up. Two lock up here. Clinton again with that overhead belly to belly. Pulls Gilliam away. Cover here. One. Two. Gilliam able to kick out. Two lock up. Irish with the middle corner. Gilliam measuring. Takes the run of it again. Scores with that boot. Two lock up. Knee lift there by Gilliam. Two lock up. Whoop. He has Clinton up. Into the slam. Has him up. Lock up here. Shot right to the face. Big headbutt there by Gilliam. Puts him back up. Has all oh, the belly to belly. And it sends Gilliam crashing to the outside. What's he going after? Two lock up. Oh, but Clinton with the backdrop onto the floor. Oh, and he just leveled him with that right hand. It's Gilliam up, trying to go behind, however, got caught. And now Gilliam alone with the punches here. Down goes Clinton. Quick stomp, stomp to the leg as well. Gilliam rolling back inside. Clinton going back as well, but he has a chair in hand. Oh, and he... Freaking just caught him with it. Oh, but Gilliam for paying him again with that low blow. Off the rope, stomp to the back. Two lock up. Gilliam, double underhook. And to the backbreaker. Gilliam now with the sleep aid locked in. Clinton in a lot of trouble here. Is he going to submit? No, he's able to break free. Quick, oh, couple of stomps into the ribs. Whoop. Two lock up. Whoop, and Clinton is done loaded with that barrage of punches and taking down Gilliam. Whoop, Gilliam up on his feet. He's looking very dazed, however. Whoa, takes Clinton down with that right hand. Gilliam now has him. Oh, who is that head? But right to the back of the head. 
Arm caught with the elbow. Irish whip. Gilliam way to go with a right hand. Gilliam now to the top. Oh, puts him back up on his feet, however. Sends him into the corner. Gilliam, as he got in store here, as he puts Clinton up to Oh, but Clinton with the headbutt. Lock up. Oh, there's a shot right across the back. Let's get him away from the corner. Has him up. Lock up here. Oh, but Gilliam has him on the throw. Neck deep. Cover. One. Two. Three. He got him. Here is your winner by pinfall, Jeff Gilliam. And Jeffy G able to score the victory here. Caught. Clinton completely by surprise, putting him away with his pad neck deep. Uh, Gilliam able to string together some more victories here. He's unlucky for Clinton, so it looks like he continues to head down that downward slope. All right, without further ado, folks, let's go ahead and jump right on in to the next one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Gowrie, Iowa, weighing in at 345 pounds, Roy Case. Case was coming off a victory from two weeks ago, having defeated Cliff Clinton in what was one hell of a fight between those two. He's looking to continue his winning ways here. And his opponent, from Columbus, Ohio, weighing in at 190 pounds, Jason. Justice! A world heavyweight champ. He's coming off a loss from two weeks ago. I haven't been defeated by Hyperion and what was honestly kind of a rather one-sided affair for the likes of Hype there. I know the champ's looking to bounce back here, especially since it's a normal contendership match. Uh, pretty much after this, he's definitely be looking to get as much momentum as he can heading into whatever pay-per-views Kingsley has planned next. It's underway. Whoa, Justice pulling the case down. Whoa, and now just that already hammering with those elbows. He's able to get a few solid ones yeah. in. Scoops case up, sends him tumbling to the outside. One. And Roy quickly rolling back inside. To lock up. Justice with that shot to the ribs. Pulls case away. Ooh, got met with that kick right to the head. Lock up here. Ooh, four right across the back. Case now. Has Justice up, spins around, into the power bomb. Managing a count of one. Lock up. Case with the rib breaker. And now hammering away with the right hands here. Justice able to knock him aside. Lock up. Irish whip. Coming off as well. Taking out that running elbow. Under the guard position. Oh, Case. Got a guillotine choke applied here. Using that amateur wrestling background of his. Justice trying to pin him down. Whoa, rolls over. Anaconda choke. Case able to quickly pick the lock on it. Rose Justice right down. Rolls him away. As a, uh, oh, discus lariat. My God. A couple of stomps to the legs there. Over the with that right hand. Whoa, whoa, nope. The shoulder throw there by Justice. Lock up. Shot right to the ribs. Up to the leg. This is that right hand, Irish whip. Justice waiting. Ooh! Got pulled over there. Roy pulled him away, clips up to the leg. Another stomp. Oh, to lock up your case. Has him up, however, military press into the slam. Pulls Justice away from the ropes. Looks up to the leg. Has him up again. Avoids the clothesline. Lock up. Justice sends him into the corner. I'm trying to measure him, but Roy stepping away has him up once more. There's the slam. Case now stretch him up for applied here. <coughs> Excuse me, but just his foot was able to come in contact with the rope. Justice now with the elbow. Champ trying to retake it, the offensive here, but Case looking to stay one step ahead of him and just slamming his head. Off the canvas here. Oh, God. 
Just is actually bleeding from it as well. Case has him up. Throws him down. Oh, and Case now with a cover here. One, two. Just is able to kick out. Lock up here. Case has him up. Point Buster. Cover. One, two. Chambo hit the shoulder up. My God, does he ever have to be dazed? Combined with the fact that he's bleeding from the head slams, but also that brain buster as well. Pulls Case away. Coming off the ropes. Oh. Case up on his feet. Has him up. Military press into the slam. Lock up. Justice with a gut wrench suplex. Cham trying to get some offense in here. There's the elbow. Pulls Case away. And off the rope, Swanton across the back. Two, oh, lock up here. Oh, but Case, wrist, wrist clutch exploder. Right on the back of his head, cover here. One, two. Champ out with a kick out just in the nick of time. Scoops Case up, slams him down. Justice to the top. Oh, my second thoughts about it. Case was stirring rather quickly. Gets the champ up in the military press. Dumps him right down on the canvas. And now has him back up. Lock up here, but Justice with the elbow. Has Case up. Whoop, I call it the elbow. Big Haas coming off the ropes. Oh, Luthes press. One, two. Justice able to kick out. Lock up. There's the elbow. Circles around in front. Open case again, military press! It dumps the champ to the floor! One, two. Oh, rear waist lock just spins behind. A series of punches in the head there. That's Big Hoss up. Irish whips and some crashing to the guardrail. But case with the Falcon Air onto the floor! Oh god! Justice! Ooh! Dragon's going to the floor, trying to mobilize Case there a bit. Big Hoss back inside. Oh, but Case with a Falcon Arrow! Like it's hooked! One, two! Justice out with a power out! Case with the axe handle! Going up top! Diving splash across the back! Oh my god, it's going up again! Another splash! Oh my lord! As champ up! Oh, but Justice half edge suplex! He goes up top! Connects with the leg drop! Pulls Case away. Has him up. Lock up here. Ooh, got caught with the axe handle, Case. Oh my god, not again! Another splash! Looking for it again! Oh. Second thoughts about it, Justice was stirring. Oh, and Case! Inverted Emerald Flosion! As Justice up! Oh, here they go. Case, Justice, Case, Justice. Case with the headbutt! Now getting a breather in while he can. Champ up on his feet. Lock up, Irish whip. Coming. Oh my god, a spear! Cover one! Three, got him! Here is your winner by pinfall, Roy Case! And Big Hoss able to overcome the world heavyweight champion here. Oh my god. From being honest, for the most part, Case was really in control there. I had a few slip-ups here and there where he was letting Justice get some offense in, but I think the blood loss was also affecting the champ there in that as well. But nevertheless, congrats to Case on a massive victory here tonight. All right, without further ado, folks, let's go ahead and jump right on in to the main event of the evening. I'm excited for this one. The following contest is scheduled for one plus for the number one contendership to the SCCW World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing first, from New York, 
weighing at 345 pounds, Hyperion! The hype still rocking his unbeaten streak here. But the question is, will he be able to continue it here tonight? And his opponent from Louisiana, weighing in at 286 pounds, Allen Galloway! You know, the right-hand man coming off a rather stunning victory two weeks ago, having knocked out Bodie within a matter of about five and a half minutes. Finds himself in another number one contendership match, but against perhaps one of his toughest opponents here to date. We'll see how things go as Hyperion already with a big body slam there. Galloway rocks him with that headbutt. Quick stomp to the ribs. Lock up. Hyperion with the arm drag. Drops the elbow right to the jaw. Two, start putting him out. Lock up here. Hype. Push him back. Ooh, little frame shot right to the back of the head. Quick stomp. Galloway back up on his feet. Oh, it would avoid the clothesline. Oh, over. Over and punch there by Hyperion. Gets thrown to the corner. Ooh, but again catches Galloway with another overhand punch. All right, time for the form across the back. Comes Galloway over, cover here. Galloway able to get the shoulder up. Lock up. Hype with the body slam. And hammer away with the left hands here. Galloway able to knock on the side. Lock up. Oh, it's a face breaker there by Hyperion. Drops the elbow. Back up. Hype with another shot right to the ribs. Away, drops the elbow. Lock up. Elbow right to the jaw. Height pulls him away. Now we away with the right hands here on Galloway. Allen able to knock him aside. Lock up. That elbow to the, to the jaw. Another elbow drop there. Lock up. Irish whip puts Galloway in the corner. Oh, but Galloway with the arm drag. Pulls up here on the way from the corner. Two lock up. Galloway dumps hype to the outside. Blue rolls back in. Lock up. Hype with the elbow. Stomps the back of the head. Avoid some clothes on there from Galloway. Lock up. Oh, the first principle! Oh my god! Cover one, two! Galloway kicks out, but Jesus Christ, that came out of fucking nowhere! Body slam there by Galloway. Oh, and avoid the head by him. Oh, but gets caught with the face breaker. Pulls Allen away from the ropes. And hype with that stomp. Oh, avoids the boot. Galloway with the elbow. Has hype up, avoids the headbutt. Pulls into the ropes. Galloway coming off. Oh, from the clothesline. Oh, got caught by the throat, and there's the high one. Cover one. Galloway kicks out. Walk up. Galloway with a big slam there that sends Hyperion tumbling to the outside. Really needs to try to string some offense here. And here they go. Allen. Hype. Allen. Hype. Allen. Hype winning the exchange. Drops to a knee for a second there. As Galloway up. Galloway with the left hand avoids the headbutt. Oh, caught with the face breaker. It's a knee drop there from Hyperion. He has Galloway up. Lock up here. Galloway with the elbow. Oh, stare. Oh, avoids the tackle there. Galloway. The big body slam. Charging off the ropes, but Hype makes it to his feet. Sends Galloway into the ropes. Waiting. All oh, has him. Bear hug applied here. Give up. Oh, near center of the ring as well. Galloway able to wiggle free. Lock up. Oh, there's a shot right to the throat. Hype back up to his feet here. Goes behind. Galloway takes him down with the backdrop. Ooh, levels him with that clothesline. And again. Lock up. Galloway. Oh, my, I've been looking for that German suplex of his. Hyperion off the ropes, and there's a stomp. Lock up. Oh, oh. Hype has him. Up! Oh! Last ride, powerbomb, cover, one, two! Galloway able to get the shoulder up in time. Lock up. Oh, but high man the slam, cover, one, two! Galloway kicks out again. Lock up. Throws 
Goes in now with the arm throw. That's hype up. Galloway sidewalk slam. Both been up on their feet. Galloway, another sidewalk slam. Whoa, got caught with that shot to the ribs. Oh, but hype has him up. Even higher into the power bomb. Cover one, two. Galloway kicks out yet again. Just trying not to let the opportunity escape him. Into the slam. Caught up in the ropes. Galloway has a modified Northern Lights bomb. Pulls hype away. Sits him up. Galloway off the rope. The act of God. Cover. One, two. Hype kicks out. Lock up. Irish whip. Waiting. Oh, what a spine buster. That's Galloway up. Caught him with the knee. Adds him back up. Oh, and he got caught with that jawbreaker. Galloway, stomp right to the jewels. Has Hyperion up. Got him with the left. Oh, but he gets dropped with that face breaker. And Hype has him up. Galloway with the Irish whip, however. Oh, what a spine buster. Hyperion back up. Oh, and Hyperion has him up. Even higher into the power bomb cover. One, two, three, he got him. Here's your winner and the new number one contender to the number SEC World Heavyweight Championship, Hyperion. And the Mad Titans undefeated streak yet continues here as he now punched his ticket to face Jason Justice at the upcoming pay-per-view. One really does have to ask the question, is the man truly beatable at this point in time? All right. Man, I'm not going to lie. I was really pulling for Galloway to come out on top there because it's really got potential to make it big. And that was definitely going to be one hell of a challenge either way. Would have been damn near impressive. Not why I'm saying damn near would have been hella impressive had he come out on top and been the one to snap Hyperion streak, but fortunately, not, uh, not the case tonight. But nevertheless, again, congrats to Hyperion on becoming the number one contender. Uh, but now with all that in mind and all that wrapped up, I can, uh, I think we might be running short on time here. Uh, I can quick, can probably quickly go over. Uh, what Kingsley has drawn up and this is also actually also a message out to everyone else in the XHF network those who especially are interested in the tag division uh, what Kingsley has come up with and also what I am backing is a big tag team tournament that will be hosted by SCCW uh, much like our high roller formerly known as the gold rush during our MCCW days it will function just like that in a round robin style tournament uh, with two blocks, with the first place teams in each block advancing to a final match. Winner of that will be the winner of the tournament, or as it's been come to known, and rather aptly so in my opinion, it is the Saints and Sinners Cup. So, uh, we, for the past month, have been gathering some inside interest to see who would be interested in participating, and from what I've gathered so far, there has been... Uh, the Sons of Loki, representing the Harbingers, the combination of Jormungandr and current uh, international champion Fenrir. There is the Immortals, Hyperion and Bodhi. The Case Brothers, consisting of Roy and his newly signed brother Bubba. And a few others as well that I know will has also garnered some uh, outside interest as well. In order to have a partner for them to compete in. Uh, so there is definitely that. Uh, there will probably be some more information posted on it later uh, in the week, maybe close to the weekend, uh, once we kind of finish assessing the inside interest from everyone within the roster first to see if they might be interested and they have someone outside they want to bring in. So we'll be finding out uh, soon enough. But yeah, that's the big announcement and the thing that's been in the works for the coming weeks. So I really hope that all of you will be uh, as excited for it when it happens as I am. It is set to begin sometime in the middle of March. Uh, pretty much I think the week after the next big pay-per-view uh, that's lined up. So, yeah, there's definitely that to look forward to. And I, for one, am very excited to see how things will go out. But, yeah, 
Uh, just to quickly go over time, because since that's pretty much the announcement that I had to make, uh, as per usual, thank you to all those who came out tonight. Thank you to those who uh, tuned to our broadcast on our YouTube channel. Support means everything to us in Stay One. And, yeah, once again, my name is Aster Mayfield. Thank you all so much for tuning in, and I'll see you all tomorrow night for another installment of Thursday Night Ignition. Take care, and good night.